the Earth Shaker, obviously uh, for the Fissure Steel, but also if you can uh, net a little Doom for yourself, it's not a bad thing. And I guess it does make the lane which are really, really strong. It's gonna be a gank. That is good enough for the Invoker, like the Doom basically. Oh, they're gonna turn this? Wait, they can't. That's easy. You can have Maposhka coming from the side. The Centaur Clapper will also be there as well. They'll have the one charge as Farmer. With the help of Puppy, they're looking to kill off Scandal, but the damage is already done. That's easy, will drop and Universe. Moves off that top lane, he was only creep as well, so this tower is... That was, that was a really good play yeah. from Seeker, managing to actually defend this tower. Like, it's a very important thing. Cause... Afterlife, bottom lane, Envy just right around the back, combining up with our TZ Sunstrike, Team Secret. A roping that Sander inside of him, is able to blast through, and with the Frostbite, the creeps can't even reach the tower. They frost by one, they devour the other, and now Team Secret will finally admit the fact they can deny the tower with a cold out from Rambi to pick up on Puppy. They're looking for more action, and they're gonna find it with Pilot Eye dropping. Puppy, the visual by a little bit of space, but it's probably not gonna be enough. He turns around as much damage as he can to the Enchantress, but they lose two heroes. And in and order to get that got, tower... Enchantress got the last hit, but playing faster tempo, taking towers, taking the fight to Secret. And you talk about Clink's rotating, but once Clink starts roaming, that's when Beastmaster will also do the same. He's going to be hitting level 6 soon. <laughs> He's also going to be, well, getting solo killed by Clink's. <laughs> Easiest, easiest kill for Eternal Envy, but now Randy's looking for some revenge. Eternal Envy can't go in for just two more seconds. Randy gets a very quick rebuttal kill. And what's exactly where they're going to head down, Maposhka? He's farming on the other side of the tree line, so Envy may just go instantly in for this Enchantress. With a Fissure, the lock him in position. Three Searing Arrows will do the job. How much more can they get with a roar? Envy stuck for the moment. The call down is there, but that Sun Strike right on top of Randy. He's almost out. No, he will not. Envy gets the last arrow win. He's still very low himself. Half-Life can't finish the job, can they? Over to the side, no, Half-Life is down! Envy will keep himself on kill, and the Icarus Slam will help bring Empire to their knees! Position Maposhka actually runs just the right way, nope, he's gonna turn. Bum, here comes the Sun Strike, right on top of him, and there's the damage! Three arrows, four arrows will be required! And that will find the kill, and Envy even takes the smoke. They don't have any kind of... Well, actually, they have a sentry water over on King R, but they don't see Eternal Envy. They don't realize it. They last him over on Puppy. He does have the Doom, so they want to kill him off in time. The two arrows. Rubik almost goes down to this, and he'll get Norbit down by Pilai Dai. Roaming him from the side. Puppy is still very, very low, but surviving through it until the cooldown will finally connect with the Blink forward. It will be a two-for-one trade-off. And this Gyrocopter is doing some heavy li lifting for a team. What is a every Here they come. Secret, now they try and do the, the smoking bad habit. Four spirits move up, scouts out half life. Scandal still waiting here, and the Fissure catches through! That can be big, Envy, look for the early damage! Puppy already burns the Doom as well, so Rubik will be taken out this fight. Unfortunate for them. It was also a really good play by Secret, because the smoke popped on the Forge Spirit, so immediately Secret knew where, Secret knew where Empire was because of that. The damage, the Fissure will help him out. Again, Clink's trying to... One core in the Gyrocopter. If this game gets dragged out, Secret will have a huge advantage. Yeah, they're also waiting for the blink oh. from, from Universe. King R will die, but he breaks the smoke and this will still buy time for Empire to finish up Roshan. Life's like sending the Hawk over at the moment, but Clink's man, he's doing so much damage to Roshan. He's not going to stun this before Empire can even get in there. And Roshan will go down, Eternal Envy. Well, the Aegis model had to be taken by Artis because Envy was stunned up in Half-Life. He can't get anything else off. Envy is low, but there's no real follow-up. Empire and Master and Team, those are movements you need to be scouting out. Yeah, you should be ahead uh, in terms of vision against the enemy team. And yeah, Beast Master. Oh, also. Lasso, yeah, Pilot Eye. Empire will take anything they can get right now. It's not even that a uh, big of a scepter build, which isn't like your typical drums or Dragonlance, Aghanim scepter, which allows you to do damage. It's purely just trying to keep himself alive. Here they come, the Fissure, the Sun Strike's gonna connect, and Ramsey's all that freshly bought. Helm of Iron Will will drop. That actually means that the only remaining outer towers for Team Empire belong on the bottom lane, but Envy, well, he came underneath the uh, sentry while well, they drag him far enough down, but, well, they still need to see him. The problem was, the Dustus wasn't there in time until now. Jarakov to getting the big kill. All of Team Empire helping out, and there's that blink last through four staff going to work. Can they find more? That's easy. Dropping down the meatball, right on top of They're gonna let it go right now on Maposhka as well. They're all trying to retreat out. The Doom, the Jarakov is able to bring him down. As they just go for a little bit more, there's still this top battle. The Sun Strike's not enough to kill off the Enchantress, they'll bail out of this one too. But that Earthshaker is just on the run, he's got a blink available, but is he going to save his captain? Arteezy is doing everything he possibly can with that Ice Walk going down. He'll come in, even try and put on the Colt feet to slow down Scandal. But he cannot do enough, so Puppy will die. Then maybe, okay, Arteezy, can he really get a revenge kill here? King R is low. But Arteezy, Sun Strike's back off cooldown. 
So I'm waiting for him just to have a crack at it, but it looks a little bit too easy. Afterlife, the sentry will take to reveal it. eternal envy. Yeah. And there, there's your yeah. roar. Hold in position. Necro puts down, but as much as you can. The cooldown's coming as well. It's gonna be enough damage, even just from the first rock at the falls. Eternal envy will go down. Not right now. I actually have... Okay, there's only one sentry one on them. I don't have an observer one, but... Okay, Arteezy's to find them. Big target, and they've found him as well. The two will go on Scandal. It's the stunts. Can they hold him there? The cooldown's back up. Arteezy, so low. Ramsey wants to finish him off, but he's gonna get him as well. Meanwhile, Puppy is still chasing out Scandal. You let it go there from Pylai dying. But the damage... You may have picked up a bat rider, but you just... Hey, wait. Scandal. Can he find something right now? He's gonna look for it. The four star for Lance getting frostbitten up. The river widen there's your doom for Puppy. Roar is up. Randy's the call will happen, but he got instantly done and echo sand up by Universe. The Yules. Randy's actually got a little bit of extra time up in the air. Pop is now with BKB and come back down to Earth. The Beast Mask may be the first casualty of war. Puppy is almost gonna join him, but Randy's he just can't find finally he will. Arteezy's last bit of damage to kill him off. The Bat Rider before Bat Rider yep. did anything. The puppy's uh, having a hell of a game, but it wasn't enough for Secret Needs 5. Uh, well, as soon as like they get the cash on the RTZ, in this case it was a telekinesis into the gyrocopter. Like Aghanim Scepter perhaps less so. Even though there's ulties to go scandal. They're gonna go. Envy killed off the horse, but he's still stuck around to finish farming up the camp. And now a rest of Empire move over with the roars and impetus damage. Scandal is the one to be rewarded with the kill. And a turtle. You kill the hawk, you're immediately oh. gonna run away. RTZ? Oh. Right, there has a jam, he sees him. He's gonna blink forward, gonna keep that sticky yeah, nose up, but he's gonna rotate over, Scandal's in trouble, Flame Break pushed out, Arteezy got the gem, he wasn't trying to escape from this and he will, so the gem is lost as the rest of Empire, they, it's this time, their turn to be a little bit too far behind, they're yeah. making for a kill on the mid. They can't find it yet, but that Dire Observer Wolf, which is still looking at Pilot Eye perfectly, they're gonna come up, they find Arteezy, they break the Lincolns and get the last two off, with the cooldown, Arteezy has no way to get his way, get away out of this fight. I just have to accept the fact that he is dead. Buy back and the CRP just on Gyro. <laughs> May not have to buy back if no one TP's top. Maybe he's gonna get an okay trade here. Oh, Poppy picks up. He just tries to battle on Green, but then thrown so far into the Empire Lounge to be four stopped up. But Ramsey's. He'll find the final bit of damage. They're even looking for Clink away. And Envy, he's burnt the BKB. So he runs deeper into the Diatide. He wants to find a kill for this for the blank disjoints, the attack, and King R. He may take the damage. He gets the final pickup, however, allowing Scandal to get the last two. Off life to war of Babel as well. Scandal! 44 lives! They're gonna try to find the kill on him! The Sun Strike is even denied! Well, the BKB's up, Team Secret, they want to try and fight, Scandal comes in with the Shadow Blade, Pilot Eye drops the Sentry Ward down, but Scandal blinks and four times over, the Sun Strike's gonna hit and Scandal will be lost. The Gem of True Sight, laying on the ground at the moment, and now Tornado also picking up Envy, he's gonna get roared up, the Ice Wall is out, Ramsey brings in the damage, Envy gets dropping so low, he tries to get packed up, but he gets the life, does he have the damage? No, he does not! Ramsey's will survive, Matisse, he was trying to find from the other side of the trees. But he couldn't find him in universe, now they go in, but Rubik, okay, he'll die as well. Uh, that was the butterfly they're doing. MZs. As Radiant Courier, okay, hello. Uh, Hawk's gonna see that pretty easily. Quick roar and quick snipe. I was moving down to what cracks for this. This Aegis better be worth it for Team Empire because they are very far out of position. Melee Rags will be lost. They're teeping back right now. Tomato going to pick up her for the Rubik King R. Well, he'll go down. Too much damage. Too much control again. Puppy, the last to win back up into Tier 4 Tower. But if you take Rex and a one for one hero trade off, if you're secret, you're running all the way to the bank, especially considering Empire. They did not finish secret. In a strong position. Oh, here they come. Rubik Fables, the creep wave up on the top, just once, and now they come in, and there it is, the snatch! Scandal's got it! He takes the Aegis to the Immortal, but is the damage really done? You'll have the uh, Bat Rider coming back up in just a couple of moments. Time for Ramsey's. He's at the mouth of the pit, trying to kill off Puppy again, walking away underneath that scorch. And so much life, they just can't catch him any further. Up the hill and far away, King R. Now triggers the Lincoln Sphere over an Arteezy. Need to put that vision to work, Puppy. Let he's still on the run here. The roar is there from half life. Will he want to use it? Probably not if he can save it for another kill, which they could do. Pilot Die is also work. on the run. Pilot Die lets the ulti go, but as you said, Arteezy knocking on the tier 3 tower in the mid. Multiple rapiers being funded by Team Empire. Arteezy gonna walk in. He's underneath that ghost walk moment, but it costs. They see him again, easily triggering off that Lincoln Spear, allowing them to follow up into the damage.
and bring on TZ. They're missing on the map. No one's forcing in the mid lane. No one's actually pushing out the bottom lane too, but it's the mid lane where Scandal, Shadow Blaze in. He gets the last two on pump, but he may lose King after this one. He actually had the Ghost Walk on cooldown, so it'll be a support for a support trade off. But can they find any more? The last two's already been expended. Pilot I've been bumped around by that flame break, and then the Echo Slam. Here it For the BKB4, though, Yule's have the rub. They really want the Beastmaster with the Sun Strike. They're gonna get him! Eternal Envy! Now the damage into the Enchantress. He gets a mini fast, but Envy dies at least a tier 3 tower. Ramsey's buyback is giving the damage back over to Team Empire. But they need to find some extra kills here and make this buyback really worth it. Universe appears to be on a silver platter for them, and Gyro will take his life. They still have trouble on the team. Just feel the bait on the hook. The question is, the secret one to buy the tornado picks up two of his scandal. He's ready to jump on Arteezy. He'll get the last two off to Arteezy. Out this fight for the moment. Can they get another control? They're definitely blast from King Arrow. He's going to miss it completely, but Arteezy stuck on the high ground. Mahoshka, can he do enough damage? They need to keep that vision up. Arteezy's running himself away. The impetus damage of 151 life. And Empire's lost three. The damage is too much. The Echo Sand will drop as well. Can they bring down the big TPS? You bet your nearly. Mahoshka, he's a power Available. There's only the Beastmaster, and they're ready to fight again. That's easy. He even used his refresher orb he bought from the Empire base to do more work, looking for a kill. Over on Scandal, the Yules will send him up. Universe is there with a the fissure, the control. Scandal can't get himself away from the Demon of Death being blocked by the GG. Team Secret will take the game in 50 minutes against Team Empire, the team that 2 0 them in their first match here in the group stage. They fight back, it wasn't an easy fight, but they are successful. It's just crazy. Momentum was entirely Team Empire for the last 20 minutes of the game, but all it took was one big, decisive secret movement. You can see once Gyrocopter's out of the picture, they're just missing that big carry in that fight. And the other big thing is, Miposhka, that last fight, no BKB on him. He buys the Moonshot, he has a BKB there. He actually finishes that kill. He gets the kill on the Invoker, it goes completely differently, but having this Moonshot just meant that he was a lot squishier, couldn't deal with the...